today on Casino Cousins Slots. <laughs> All right, guys, Casino Cousin Slots bringing you another exciting video. We're doing a mighty cash game. Hooray! We love when this guy comes out and roars on the screen because that means we're getting something good. So let's have him come out a bunch. We're gonna change our bets around and see what we can get. Um, all right, guys, let's get it going. We're gonna start on this five cent D nom, uh, 240 bet. And oh, first the first spin! Man. First he spin! <laughs> Free games, but Free games. I'll gladly take that. That's okay, because he can come out plenty more times in the free game. Uh, we didn't have our... Uh, we didn't have that set up very well. Sorry, guys. Our shorts, our shorts camera wasn't set up very well. As a matter of fact, it's not, it's not going to be a good short. Not with the position of our camera. So anyway, first spin. Mighty Cash games, one, tend to be very streaky. Oh, oh. yeah. When lions come out, or like when it gets as random, it tends to keep doing it. Five cents, so ten. Uh, but it tends to breed more. And in free games, they tend to come out more often. So, what a start. Yep. Oh, good numbers. I love those first spin bonuses. Let's read some words. Right? A mini's at a hundred bucks. Max is oh, pretty high. These are great numbers. That's what we played it for, the back. Oh yeah, we didn't actually show anyone that. <laughs> we're gonna have to show them when we're done with uh, these, these features, or uh, bonuses. Come on. All right. I always choose left, every time. Go ahead. Two, not I'm bad. happy with that. Because I would've took right, and it would've been one. You know that happened last time we did that, and we had to chose the middle? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because we couldn't agree. Yeah. So we split the different All right. right, let's get this last one. That's uh, a triple. Come on. Oh. oh. All right, that's only the second spin of the first game. game. Oh, of three games, yeah. That's a great $81 start. $81 on that bonus. I will take that every time. what the progressive is when it lands on the screen. <laughs> oh yeah, because I don't want to, during free games, it automatically goes. Yeah, let's just drop, the, let's just drop the maxi with four other, four other cards. We're up to 90, 60. Ooh, nothing, that's good. That's fine. Oh. <laughs> it paused, it paused so I thought it was coming out. He thought the head was coming out. Ooh, no, two more spins. Ooh, God, it felt like it paused at the end. Right? Like it's last spin. Oh wow, that was a lot of deadness at the end there. Yeah, but we got a another ten, hundred dollars. We got a hundred dollar bonus on our we very sure first spin. First spin. All right. <laughs> Hopefully that is the sign of many more to come. Right. So while we're why we're playing this, that maxi is actually bigger than the major, and that's not supposed to happen. So. While there is no guarantee, there's no hit by, it's not a you know advantage play. If you're gonna play a, a mighty cash game or whatever, you know, you just yeah. go might you might as well go for the bigger one. Right. <laughs> it was waiting for us, Brian. He was just ready to pop out. It was. And a word decent line hit. I haven't played this version of Mighty Cash in quite a long time. Oh, look at that, 170. Or should I say, a uh, Long Tang? <laughs> uh, long Tang Hu uh, That is the version of Mighty Cash we're playing. At least we think that's how you say it. <laughs> that's close enough for me. Now, well, yeah, this is one, like one of the older versions. Like, yeah. One of the first versions of Mighty Cash. Ooh. You 
I'm on this, on these mighty cash games, I do uh, like to change my bet around fairly often. And I really don't. So. 1140. I usually stick to one. Yeah. But usually these mighty cash games tell you exactly the bet you have to play to get your best odds of hitting your, your progressives. Yeah. And that's why I stick to it. But this game did not tell us. No. We searched those rules. And it didn't say, oh, you know, changes with Dinom or doesn't matter Dinom. It didn't say any of that. Yeah. So this one I'm more than willing to change it around. But normally I'm playing the best chances and I'm sticking to it. Right. Yeah, I usually kind of stick to my um, somewhat normal timing, but I, I might catch it. I like to give some a little extra pause. Let that music stop. Ooh. Five seventy. You're supposed to bring out more dragons, right? We like those guaranteed features. Yeah, you're supposed to be like dragons breed dragons. I like dragons. Oh, that's actually our bet back. Yeah. For only the three frogs. Oh, normally you need more than small that. Problem, right? Just normally you need more than that. That was our bet back just for three dragons. All right, let's yeah, change. Yeah, I was literally about to uh, stay enough five cents though, huh? Yeah. Uh, let's actually stay at the same bet, but go at a little bit bigger multiplier. So we lowered the top, so now we're on the silver. Uh, but Which, we raised our multiplier. Oh, come on. Natural one. So I guess we should point out what we just did. These all change, and it changes our bets. Right. So we went from this uh, green, green down here, which changes uh, the amount that's on our those tags, but it also allows us to do a higher multiplier right. for the same bet. Red Dragon. Shoot out some fire. Right. Well, I'll take a seventeen and a half dollar. Yeah. Been a while since we got a lot of hit. Started to think maybe we shouldn't have changed. So, maybe I just don't know Chinese mythology, uh, which I don't. <laughs> Come on. But, oh. why do the why are the fish sharing a pearl? Is that like, I wonder if that's a mythological thing? Because I do know that the frog with the coin in its mouth is from mythology. Oh. I don't remember what it is, but I remember hearing about that. The coin on that. Ooh, natural? Uh, also, just like a lot of Mighty Cash games, it, if the random win doesn't come out, I don't expect to hit a natural. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Come on. That was a big one. Yeah, it was. Whatever 16 times 5 is. Alright, come on. Give us another big one. Right? You can't stop it. First one. Can't blow your whole lot on the first spin. Give us more. I want more. Because I like quoting Al Bundy, I want my biggins. I'm thinking we need to change D now. Yeah, change it. That's what I'm thinking. All right. Let's change it around. So what bet do we want to do? Ah, so uh, another thing about Mighty Cash Games, if you go on one cent and two cent, you need six of those symbols yeah. to trigger the hold and spin. 
nickels and dimes, you only need five. But when the Edgar comes, or the, when the Red Dragon comes out and roars. Uh, you know what? We're, let's play a little bit like I play yeah. Outback Bucks. Yeah. Where I hit the, the Grand with Jen. Yeah. Because this has a similar betting style. So one penny, the lowest symbol, maximum bet, which is 90 cents. Highest multiplier. You want what? The highest multiplier. Yeah, the highest multiplier. Once again, I don't know if this is actually worth it. Because there are no rules saying so. Ah. Two different things we could have got there. Two different chances at the bonus. Let's go. Where's our dragon friend? Yeah. Come on, buddy. Ooh. We hadn't done a fast one. No, we had not. Doing game, you're toying with us. You're bringing us back down to our starting before you give us a massive hit. <laughs> At least that's what you better be doing, right? Let's go. Give us that max. It's not even teasing no. us. No, it's just slowly taking it back. Start like 112 or, or 212 or something like that. 216. 216. Oh. Ah. I'll be honest, I'm thinking we play down to our starting and that way we don't lose. Uh, oh, there. Oh, on nickels now, we would have had it. However, I'm willing, I could almost guarantee on nickels we would only got four. Probably. Like yeah. I said, the game knows what it is. These games don't. Yeah. I usually, when I play, I usually only play the nickel or denoms on Mighty Cash. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be have the same effect that uh, Outback no. Bucks has. It's not even getting a line here. There's a whole lot of blocking going on. Let me block it with the free games, let me block it with the coins. For fun. For the fish. Let's go total minimum bet on ten on yeah. dimes. Just for fun, it makes sense. Just to see what the difference is. I've seen it work before. Because we're getting close to going back down to our starting. Right. This is, let's alternate the first two bets. I'll do this fair. dollar sixty, you do eighty. to trigger something here, right? Gotta play with the machine a little bit. Hopefully we can just get that dragon to come out, spit his fire. Ah, I thought it all the way. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, natural. Nice. That never happens. I'll take that. Yeah. I mean, we're betting really low, but uh, all it takes is one word. Those progressives can't come out. All it takes is one word. Still drop that grand that's a major. Two hundred dollar mini. I mean, that's a ten dollar coin right there. It is. That is pretty large compared to our bet. Six. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do a handful. Oh, free game. No. 
I've also noticed when you see the free games go by twice, it's not giving you any more. <laughs> so if you watch the last reel mm. and you see it fly by twice, you didn't get it. Ah. Oh, I forgot. I forgot to change no. that. Ah. I thought maybe that's what you wanted to do. All right, guys, let's go ahead and call it there. That was a couple good bonuses. Up by uh, 24 bucks. Yeah, not bad.